guys and welcome to my channel. In this video I am going to do another lip swatch video and today I'm going to swatch all of the new lip lingeries from NYX. I think it was a couple of years ago or maybe just one year, I don't know, but NYX came out with 12 shades at first and now they have came out with 12 new ones and those are the ones that I'm going to swatch today. So without further ado let's get started. The one that I already have on my lips is this amazing shade called 13 Scandalous. I'm going to go through with these at 13 to 24, uh, so it's easier for you to remember as well. But this is the shade Scandalous and it's this gorgeous dark grey shade. And of course this is my favourite, <laughs> I think. I haven't swatched them all but... Obviously, this is such a Evelina shade, and it's so weird, and I love it so, so, so much. Next up is the shade 14 Confident. This shade suits my eye makeup so, so much. So again, this is 14 Confident. Next up is the shade 15 Bustier, and this is a shade that I have worn before, and I absolutely love it. It's like a mix between a pink and a purple, but still very nude. I absolutely love it. So, Bustier 15. And now for the lightest shade, I think, of the bunch. This is 16 Cheekies. So, this shade is not really my favorite. And also, it looks kind of streaky on me and it dries quite, like, patchy. Maybe my lips are very dry, I didn't think they were, but um, the color is gorgeous, so maybe for summer, if I can make it work, like moisturize your lips before, maybe it looks good. <laughs> and now for number 17, Seduction. This lip shade is gorgeous, like a dark rust shade, at least on me. Does not really go with my eye makeup, but... I really really like it and it's very seductive, <laughs> yes, from the name. <laughs> Next up is 18 Cashmere Silk. This shade looks like everybody's like perfect dark nude, for like a light skin tone obviously. I don't know, it doesn't look like much, it's just a perfect everyday shade, it's like not too dark and not too light, it's just like in between. I really like it. So again, 18 cashmere silk. If I look a little bit different, it's because I've been out for an hour at a meeting and it's a snowstorm here in Stockholm. So yeah. The next shade I will swatch is number 19, Dusk to Dawn. This shade looks very like corally orangey on me. Uh, it might be because I'm pale as a ghost, <laughs> but it's really gorgeous. I really like it. If you've never tried any lip lingerie from NYX, it's this liquid lipstick that dries matte, but it's not a like liquid form when you apply it. It's more like a moussey texture. Uh, it's very velvety. It does feel a little bit thicker on your lips, I think, um, but I really love the texture of them. And yeah. <laughs> you should really go and check them out in the store if you have not yet. Next up is the shade 20 French Made. I don't even know why I love it so much but it looks so good and with my eye makeup as well. I think it's very similar to... I don't remember the name. But it's very similar to one of my favorites that I can't name right now. <laughs> but yes, again, this is number 20, French Made. Next shade is this super cool, like grayish brown called 21 Delicate... Delicate? <laughs> what? Delicate? Wait. It feels like it would be... Delicate. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce it. I would say 21 Delicate Lust. I don't know. Uh, it's very similar to the first one I wore, but like not at all. <laughs> this is 21 and this is 13. 21 is a lot more of a brownish and the other one is more gray. Ok, 
Okay, this shade looks cool, but it looks kind of weird against my skin tone, I think. I don't know, I feel a bit like gray. And even though the other one, this one was gray, I kind of liked it more as it's like a true gray. And this is just, I don't know, it's like my skin tone, but darker <laughs> um, because my skin tone is kind of gray. <laughs> So yeah, not a favorite, but I think it would look really cool on someone that has more color. Next up is also one of the lighter shades, and this one is 22 Silk Indulgent. Let's see how this goes. The other light shade did not really go well with my lips. Okay, I think the texture on this was better than the other one but it still looks a little bit patchy on me for me it's very unnatural to have a lighter lipstick than my skin tone i never wear that and i think it looks kind of weird on me but i don't know not it's not a favorite but i think it would look gorgeous on someone else next up is the darkest shade i think and it's 23 after hours I absolutely love these kinds of shades, maybe not with this eye makeup and this outfit, but it's truly just a dark brown. On my skin tone, I think it looks very cool, it looks very, I don't know, maybe dramatic, but still kind of nude-ish. <laughs> and again, it's 23 after hours. And now for the last shade, it is 24 Cabaret Show or Cabaret, Cabaret Show. I think so. This is also a shade that I go for for an everyday basis. Really cute and again does not really suit the things I'm wearing today but just with a winged liner I think it would look really cute. So yeah again this is 24... what did I say? Cabaret? 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 Oh my god it's so hard. <laughs> So that was all for this lip swatch video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And please comment down below which of these lipsticks were your favorite. Um, I think these three were my favorites. It's 13 Scandalous, 15 Bustier, and 23 After Hours. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. And I hope we'll see each other in my next video. Bye guys! Just where it was me